This video shows the simple imaging C-sharp sample from Windows Universal Platform uh, samples on GitHub. Um, so what, are we, what will we see here? It's, uh, the sample has two, uh, two parts. One, the first sample is <coughs> uh, the image to get the image properties. So you see here, uh, you may open that. Uh, you may open a, a picture and what we see here is uh, it is uh, we have the exif orientation there is no rotation and some pictures you get the uh, um, you get uh, information that it's rotated if when you have a, um, a phone for example and it's made by uh, Olympus T TG uh, a camera model. The, the camera model is also uh, uh, in implemented in the file. We may we have here the classes for safe uh, an example for saving, saving and opening, and uh, to close that. And we are able to set the um, the geotags here on our uh, on our file. And the second file, uh, second example is here imaging transform encoding. Now, when we have this one, uh, we may rotate it, yeah, and we may size it to another size. It's not the size is not shown uh, act, uh, on uh, on runtime of this picture, but when we save it, then it, it would be saved. So uh, I think the XAML uh, is. Uh, on set on universe uh, on fill um, scale on fill or stretch equals fill like this one. So <coughs> when we and, and we may okay we have this uh, rot rotations the saving saving as uh, as of as a class example there. Now when we are in the file and the sample what you get on the GitHub. Uh, folder is uh, simple imaging um, and now we start I started at a simple uh, at the solution I'll go on there that's what you get on uh, on github so you have here uh, this sample sim uh, simple imaging I'm using the C sharp example and we have here, uh, when you're starting, you start at the simple imaging uh, solution. When you double click on that, then you come on this one. Now we have here, and, and you have, when running on PC, you need, you need uh, uh, to change this one to X64. And what you see here is we have uh, the stuff on the, uh, on the main page. That's the most important stuff. And this one is loaded by the sample configuration. There are two samples, okay? That's uh, just how they handle those uh, samples. And inside, there's the first first sample will be loaded. Uh, first, the sample side. Now we have here <coughs> uh, this, uh, we have the events there on the click, click open. You can't, I think you can go there. Yeah, here it is. Um, now, sample here, the sample. Here, uh, go to the definition. So <coughs> now you may follow the, this sample how to open something. Here we have a picker, for example. And you're loading this file, loading async, uh, get, go to the definition, and then you have a token, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so this is the first one. It's not that uh, spectacular. And But you also have here, uh, at the lo loading, um, you will find how to read latitude and longitude, and the camera mod uh, model, and the uh, date when it was taken. That's sometimes important if you make a, um, an app which base bases on the date and the exif orientation, which is uh, uh, if it's rotated. And the, the second example is here, this one. Uh, there's not much not much to see at uh, the first at first moment. Um, how shall I say? 
okay what we have there is <coughs> let's run again maybe to get a better uh, point of view there uh, we have here our uh, further buttons and why did I stop there for example yeah yeah okay w what I wanted to show here on, on this side is that you have your uh, your they're loading those that stuff but that's not important for me where you have the rotating rotating rotating